latest is that having been discharged from the Azim Government Hospital, the police continue investigation at the European Hospital, where details of a profile in relation to the hospital was taken. And uh, it pinpointed the fact that the last time she visited the hospital was October last year. And she went there on a different issue regarding an ailment and not a pregnancy issue. And the hospital has also indicated in writing to the police that the have nothing to do with the lady in terms of antenatal care and management for that matter any kind of pregnancy care assistance again the police went further and took her to a fear unquanta government hospital where we sought another opinion and it's still the same story that she was not pregnant and has not delivered. And here we are, the top echelon of the Western Regional Medical Corps came in and do said the examination were done according to medical prescription and dictates. And the police earlier also provided support from the counseling unit police headquarters where the lady was taken through some therapies by our clinical psychologist. Again, to make things better and to assist the lady in all spheres, the police again provided a psychiatrist specialist uh, to talk to her and deal with her and uh, examine issues that might be interest to her and the police. That has also been done. So here we are, we still stand by the expert opinion. In such issues, that generate controversy or makes things unclear. It is good and proper for an institution like the Ghana Police Service, a foremost internal security agency, to employ the services of experts. That is why she was sent to the Axim Government Hospital. That is why she was sent to the European Hospital and for that matter, a FM Quanta hospital where experts and knowledgeable people in medicine have taken a decision that upon all the examinations, upon all things that border on medical dictates, nothing of the sort happened. Early on the day we spoke to the PA, to the Western Regional Minister, and he said, that an amount of 3,000 Ghana cities was given to the police to be used or to be paid as a ransom to these kidnappers. Has that come to the attention of the National Police Service? Certainly no. We are strictly governed by the release that we put out and the assistance that we are giving to this lady. Nothing of the sort came before the police here in Accra. Maybe the local police will have some information about that? You are just telling me, and we distance our, ourselves. The police administration distance itself from such matters.